Hello, this is Tron with Tron Tells the Truth from Bergen. For the last four, four or five months, I stayed out of Facebook. I, the only social media I've been on is Twitter, sometimes LinkedIn. After the election in September, I had to get away. I was tired. 30 years of politics has been annoying and dragging on. It's been horrible, really. I lost everything. I invested everything and was put out in the cold. I became a father in June, so with all those thoughts in my mind, I just had to re-find myself, see what I can do, what the future brings. You can call it the midlife crisis, but I'm not so sure. After I get away from Facebook for so many months, I really found out that Facebook is not places we have your real friends. It's okay. It's nothing more. It's more like how you want to show yourself, how you want to lie to the world about yourself. But I haven't missed it. But sometimes I feel like the whole world that I had is disappeared. Where are all those people I knew? Where are all those friends who once supported me and I supported them? Where are they? It's like when you're not on the social media, you cannot put up, take up your phone and say, Hi, Tron, how are you doing? Or send an email. SMS, like used to. We have more ways of communication than ever, but we still not have the ability to not talk with each other if you're not all in the same place as everyone else. We have the opportunity and we don't use it. When I was a kid, calling long distance was expensive. We used to, in Norway, we used to call people on the other side of the, of the country after five o'clock because then it was cheaper. Now you can talk with, have a live feed with your friends on the beach of Tha in Thailand in real time. Cause you're nothing. You just need no Wi-Fi on your local co coffee shop or something like that. Are we more friendly? Are we more social active? I don't know. I write with people from the Philippines, from Turkey, from India. I feel closer to them than most of my people in my own town. That's not because of social media, just because those people are also lonely. They are lonely in countries who have more, way more people than most countries in the world. But we are still lonely. We are still hidden. We are still not there. I'm going to open Facebook again and see how reaction will be and how I will react on it. But it is sad really that communication between people have come to this. That maybe that's what's wrong. Before when terrible things happen in the world, when you need to have a twenty four hour news cycle, people really cared. There were more people who thought about how people had the poverty and war and so on before but now when you have all that resources we can't do it and we have all the news about it and knowledge about it we don't do anything we sit down being angry and being lonely just trying to be where everyone else is and where we can be dumped and be cancelled maybe facebook isn't the right place maybe social media isn't the right place at all have it give me some joy but i still as lonely now as I was during two years ago. The pandemic was nicer because that brought people together. Now, when people are out of their houses and we can't come together, we are more alone than ever. This was Tron with Toronto's Drift. Have a nice day.